And hello everybody and welcome to game six of day seven of the 12 days of gaming. This one is Animal Inspector. Too many animals. Government declares animal crisis. Last buck meets its hunter. Big scoop. Please don't kill him. Oh. How to charm, astound, win over even the most jaded agent. Okay. It's a puppy! Is it my puppy? My perfect boy. My truest friend. Noble and fierce. You'll be inspected soon. But I won't wait for that. They're hiring agents. I've already applied. You're a good dog. I won't let them take you! Alrighty then. So... I'm guessing, you know, like, the, the basically the idea behind this is, is there's too many animals in the world. Oh, hello there. My name is Martha. It's wonderful to meet you, dear. Are you just starting out here as well? Yes. How exciting. I'm very much looking forward to this. It will good for you, be good for me to get out of the house. It's just... See that young man over there? Yeah. Looks like a puppy dog. So do you, actually. Why do you... Is that a belt? Or do you have, like... I don't know. Is your stomach sticking out? I tried talking to him earlier. His name is Alan. He was ru a little rude. So I'm glad you're starting here. But enough of this. I'm very excited to work with you. Well, to work near you. You're all... New employees? Okay. Well, I'm in charge here. Um, listen up. This job is pretty straightforward. Every day you get a stack of forms. Go through each one and stamp them. Approve good or useful animals. Reject bad or useless animals. Don't skip any. We take this job very seriously. Oh yeah, one more thing. Please make sure to comment on every animal you process, explaining your reasoning. It's a legal thing. I don't know. I guess that's it. Okay. That's it. Isn't there any training? A rule book or something? Um, no. Just use your best judgment. Try not to screw up. Okay, so let's actually get into... He seems nice. You think so too, right? Sure. Ah, uh, yes. A good boss, I think. Well, it seems like our day is about to begin. Okay. We'll chat some more tomorrow. All right, let's see here. We love this fuzzy dog. Uh, he species a lowly pooch. Good for petting. Approved. Good for petting. All right, so, um, ah, that's next. Tiny cat aloof kills mice. Approved. Mouse hunter. House cat, timid, reminder of simply days. He's easily come, becomes afraid. He's, he easily becomes afraid, but this cat is good. He is family. Well, I'm guessing I have to reject one of them. So, um, no use. What is this? Oh, okay, it's just stack them, stack them neat. Okay. Okay, um... Welcome back, I guess. Pretty good job yesterday. Pretty good. Some of you, and I won't name any names, but you know who you are, have been a little too liberal with approvals. The whole point of this agency is to cull the herd. That means you can't just blindly let everything through. From now on, I'll need you all to reject at least one animal. I did reject an animal. Failure to do so will result in a strike. Yeah, okay, that's it. Hello again! How was your first day? It was good! Lovely. My day was grand. Such wonderful and cute animals I had. Of course I approved them all. Though, I guess I cannot do that anymore. Oh, I hate to bring this up, but I heard... Did you really reject a kitty? Damn right, it had no use. Oh dear. Well, I'm sure you had a good reason. I guess I should get used to this kind of thing. Good luck today, dear. Thank you. Hey. We never really talked earlier. I'm Alan. I don't think I'll be here very long. 
This is bottom of the barrel stuff. Seriously bad. Like, really, just the worst. You know what I'm saying? Yep. <laughs> yeah, you get me. Anyways, good to meet you. Alright, so, no known use. Quiet. No known use. That was easy. Uh, sheds. Nervous. Uh, is, uh, resign. Good for petting. Okay. So, you know what? Sheds. Everywhere. Nah. Screw it. Alright, there we go. That's... Now, puppy dog, puppy dog is good for petting. Let's go ahead and neaten them up. Send them off. Well, uh, it's a new day, so, um, it's a bit of a space concern. Basically, what I mean is there are some concerns about space. Specifically, the space all these animals are taking up. Please prioritize rejection of larger animals. All things being equal, Zane. Anything close to human size. That's the size I'm talking about. People-sized animals. Unbelievable. After all, the whole point of this is, well, to make space, I guess. Right. Hmm. Sorry, I'm a little down. I heard Alan has been rejecting all of his animals. I do not agree with that. But he won't listen to me. He called me... Well, he called me... Said... Uh, yes, I would believe you are out of touch. Uh, reaction is fair. Ba da da da. Not a cat, of course. I was just a fish. Natural enemy of cats. Okay, yada yada yada. Yes, you don't. I do not think you should be rejecting cats. I do not think it's right. Cats are very intelligent creatures, you know. In some ways, cats are smarter than you or me. With you, it is maybe a lot of ways. Huh? Do you promise to approve the cats? No, I don't approve. I. No! I have a job to do. How's it going? I've been getting rid of pretty much all the animals. Yes, okay, so you... All right, anyway, that is all the time we have for this particular game. If you want to play it for yourself, the link is in the description down below. As always, thank you so much for watching, and stay tuned for more from Olaf Productions. Cheerio! The reason, according to Death Answer Pratchett, that children should believe in the Hogfather is that it gets them used to believing in things that are un- Oh, yeah. Oh, can't stop. All right. Wow, Graham. Well, there you have it, Pilar. He sure does-